I somehow managed to put the face of my pumpkin upside down. Actually, just the mouth. It was supposed to be up here. And this was, it was supposed to be like this. And then he would have his little smiley face right here. And I worked from the bottom to the up. And I just, I don't know how this happened. I have no idea how this happened. Oh, well, I'm going to make him work. I'm going to put a stem on him using some red heart and we're, we're going to call it good with this little sugar, I don't know what you call this. It's a pumpkin. It's supposed to be a pumpkin. Well, now it's on the floor. It's on the floor. Where are you going with that pumpkin? Where are you going with it? Do you like that pumpkin? Do you want to keep that pumpkin? I don't know if y'all can see his little feet. <laughs> He said, it's my pumpkin now. <laughs> you like that pumpkin, huh? You know, you can barely lift that pumpkin. It weighs almost as much as you do. You only weigh a couple of grams. <laughs> I know. What do you think you're doing? Hey, is that your pumpkin? Or is that my pumpkin? Kiwi? Hey, you better turn around. This is my pumpkin. What are you doing with my pumpkin? Hey. Hey. Hey, hey, give me that pumpkin. Give me, give me, let go of that safety eye. You don't need that. You're going to pull it right out, aren't you? Good Lord, bird. What are you doing? Are you happy to play with that pumpkin? Well, he managed to get one of the eyes out. <sighs> oh well. So, I fixed my messed up pumpkin. The face is still upside down. But uh, here's the completed project after Kiwi ripped its eye out. Um, I took a, uh, a note from that show Husband's Hotels, or Husband Hotel. I don't know if anybody's familiar with that show. It's on Amazon Prime. And uh, stitched an X over where he pulled the eye out. Um, he doesn't want anything to do with it now that the eye was ripped out. Um, but, uh, yeah. So here's my finished little upside-down one-eyed pumpkin. I think it'll fit in great at Scream Hollow. <laughs>